What's up gamers? Welcome to our video today guys and in today's video we're going to be talking about the uh, three-headed rushing attack for the Atlanta Falcons and uh, I got a couple different things that I like to do uh, out of this. We're trying to show this out of only quick audibles and uh, whoops I accidentally snapped the ball but um, we're trying to show this out of only quick audibles and that's kind of the, the theme here. I accidentally hit flip sides again. Dang it. Uh, sorry about that. Let me just run a play and get down here. But um, we're trying to show you only quick audibles. We're not trying, you know, we're, that's kind of the theme here. And obviously you can do these split offs that you can set the fullback inside and power O. We talked about that last week. Um, here we'll just show you a basic run defense here, 3-4 solid trio sky. Uh, it's probably one of the more popular ones in the community right now. Uh, but the, the reason we don't go split offset is because it doesn't fit our personnel. We can't audible to it. Um, but what you could do here, and there's a couple different things. Now, let me just note a couple runs here. Um, the strong stretch is really good out of the tight pair. It's really good red zone running play. Uh, I think out of I-form, they actually have a halfback blast you could use. It's pretty good. The jumbo, they have really good running plays. They have the ta off tackle. That off tackle gets really good blocking. Uh, what I like, probably my favorite 3 headed rushing attack, is this close dive weak, and you can just flip it left and right. Uh, or you could go ATL zone weak, and with the halfback dive, it's your quick audible down. And that could be your 3 headed rushing attack, uh, obviously, in any playbook for the most part. Uh, but we want to really kind of try to show you a quick audible that you can get to uh, in the no huddle situation, to where if they're not honoring your running game, you can uh, check down to it. So something like this single back uh, doubles, this uh, running play inside zone. Obviously, you could set like the bubble screen or something as your quick audible, but this is the stock quick audible. And you see, this inside zone just does a really good job. Wow. Uh, <laughs> as I say that, um, what it does a good job of is get it gets this nice little seal on the inside and gets you off. Now, obviously, we're going up against three, four solids, so this would be more of an ATL zone week would be a little bit better of a run against it because it's a more run heavy style. And so what I'm saying, I guess what I'm getting at here is if they spread out, if you see some kind of like a dime look, that's when this run becomes really good. Okay, so it's more of a quick audible run, more of a quick snap. Okay, he's not paying attention, and I just check. I just happen to check down to it and take advantage of the uh, personnel he's got on the field. Uh, so that's kind of what we get done here. Obviously, I wanted to talk about the PA ATL corner. Uh, this play is really effective. Uh, what's interesting to note about it is the way that they run the play action is basically exactly like they run the, the halfback slam. Okay, So you can mess with the play action. Uh, obviously, the inside zone, you can run, you can jam it up in the middle if you wanted to. You can playmaker it to the left and run it off the left edge. Uh, it's just a really nice little inner, inside running play that you could do a lot with. Uh, what's also interesting is there's another formation here single back tight doubles I run a lot of plays out of it and their quick audible down is just a halfback dive I usually will motion this receiver over and since it's a halfback dive I can just snap right in the A gap or something and try to get a obviously Bobby Wagner came through on a freaking tear because it's trio sky but uh, hopefully you get the idea and then uh, the only other run that I thought would be interesting to show you is a single back bunch halfback slam and obviously this would be flipped in the real game but you just playmaker to the right and it kinda just gets some nice unique blocking it's a nice smooth transition uh, from your base play which is the bunch uh, but what's I really like this inside zone guys I think it could be its own 3 out rushing attack uh, if you need to get it done the cool part about it is it's quick audible obviously if you want to go with a true 3 headed rushing attack I'd recommend the ATL zone week from the single back ace uh, they do have it in this playbook come out in the zone week and then you can run the dive and then you can uh, also do some quick passes from the single back ace so that's what we've got for you today but that's the 3 headed rushing attack out of the Atlanta playbook hopefully this video uh, gave you some insight as to how I like to run the ball out of the Atlanta playbook